Good morning, folks. Half past seven. A.M. One six twelve or January six, two thousand twelve. Folks, uh, this was the sun. Or this was sunrise about an hour ago. Forty five minutes ago, uh, maybe half hour ago. I don't know. I. It don't look normal to me. It don't look like the old days. You know, I'm, I'm talking about that uh, that reddish tint in the atmosphere. But then you know what uh, I've heard, or I've read on the internet or something. I don't hear anything. I don't talk to pe many people. I don't want to talk to anybody. Basically, but uh, this just might be uh, Fukushima radiation in the atmosphere. Yep. How more convenient of a way to uh, start to eliminate the uh, population by. Uh, creating this uh, disaster. <clears throat> I mean, who knows? Maybe the government had nothing to do with it. I think it did. Anything rotten that happens in this world is usually uh, caused by the government. Lately, maybe. Well, I who knows? Maybe I'm wrong on that one, too. Uh, you know what? Uh, I was listening to this internet uh, radio program last night. And a lot of people were, uh, you know, with degrees, uh, diplomas, education, etc. Were mouthing off and pissed off about this... Uh, stuff going on. I know the government uh, uh, National Defense Authorization Act of 2011. I suppose it has some different names, folks. You, uh, but I that's the way it is. But, uh, so anyway, uh, three quarters through the show, the show went offline. And the government, uh, I even have that uh, with my uh, system. I'm sure the government is uh, watching my videos or what have you uh, more than anybody else is. So, good morning, government. You know what? See, this is kind of moist. You know, this is my little humidor thing. Put a little water in here and the sponge. Now maybe if I have a smaller humidor thing, you know, maybe just uh, uh, a smaller bit of a sponge or something. Uh, <clears throat> I don't know. Uh, maybe I should leave it up. Well, I'll see how this smokes. If this smokes really bad, really moist, then I'll take the top off. It'll dry out. Um, you know what, folks? If uh, Jesus uh, was here, he'd probably be in jail. He'd probably be in Guatemala Bay or Gizmo. So if the path of uh, our government is war, and you are anti-war, now war is violent, and uh, we have seen that uh, 
there's an awful lot of uh, American military personnel who like killing anything indiscriminately for pleasure or clubbing sheep to death with a baseball bat for pleasure. <clears throat> yeah, you know what, this one guy, uh, I guess he was a major reporter and he worked for uh, Ronald Reagan and Ford and Nixon or something like that. He said, uh, and I've always said this too, but when he saw the uh, collateral murder from uh, uh, WikiLeaks, how that uh, chopper pilot or that uh, chopper gunner gunned down those innocent people, he said when he saw that, he had a very heavy heart that this country has uh, lost its footing. You know what? It may never have had a footing. Look at we killed the. Um, look what we did to the American Indian. Look at what we did. Uh, false flag for uh, uh, Vietnam War. Yes, we attacked ourselves or or something. I I don't know. It's a, it was a false flag or something. I don't know. You look it up. Golf of Tonkin. And we and subsequently, fifty four thousand American. People died and we murdered two million Vietnamese. Two million people. But anyway, uh, and then the you know uh, there's lies about World War Two. The President of the United States knew the Japanese forces were on their way or something like that. I don't know. But, uh, let's see, you know, my biggest, latest, biggest, latest disappointment was when the Supreme Court didn't give a shit in the Troy Davis case that every, that, uh, perjury, uh, false, uh, testimony, recanted testimony, was a part of a uh, trial. So I think I think a majority ruled through some people on the Supreme Court that thought it was important. I don't know. But anyway, folks. Uh, <clears throat> you know, I'm uh, I'm nervous. You know, they just might come and take me away. Folks, uh, what am I going to do? I believe in telling the truth. And being a good person. I believe in trying to be kind. Trying to have compassion. Trying to have tolerance. And our government doesn't seem to show any of this stuff. So does that make me anti-government? You know, the, uh, I seen, uh, I'm not going to find it. Because I get this picture set for, at this, uh, sunrise. But in that uh, Benjamin, or Bradley, Benjamin Manning, the guy that, uh, ex I don't know, released uh, the documents that the WikiLeaks got from the uh, government, the uh, government prosecutor said it's a war crime to expose war criminals. It's a crime to explore, uh, to expose criminal activity. 
to inform the uh, public, to inform uh, anybody. It's just something. You have to look it up. Uh, I posted it somewhere, but... Yeah. It's a crime. If, if you see something wrong... And it's one of my bees, folks. I let a lot of people know that... Uh, we're, there's lies in the courtroom. There's lies in the city. There's lies uh, in the uh, in, in that little case, that case I had. The Illinois Crime Commission. I let the Illinois Crime Commission know. Yeah, they don't give. I let every single law professor in Illinois know about this. They don't give a shit. One of them wanted to know uh, if they had. If that uh, district attorney was in his class, you know what? The, how do I know? You know what I mean? The northern northwestern branch of the federal court building. I let every one of those judges know of this criminal activity, and then if you look a little further. You're going to see a whole mass of uh, extortion, bribery, payoffs, kickbacks. Yep, we don't really give a shit. So the uh, judge that uh, threw the red uh, uh, blog, sentence blog of 17, 27 years to jail, we're talking about a bribe. His, that judge aided and abetted uh, the criminals that actually did do bribes and perjury, and you know. Then you get into wire, you get wire fraud, you get uh, all sorts of federal uh, charges, and uh, that federal judge had read uh, blog of the riot act. Riot act. He did the same thing. He aided and abetted uh, criminal activity. But you know what, folks? These people get a, got a get out of jail card. And there's no plan on changing it. So, folks, my life. Anybody's life would be a lot simpler if they went with the flow of the criminal activity or what they thought was wrong. Oh, that's a loaded subject. These people that do things that are wrong don't even know that it's wrong. They, uh, they lost total lack of uh, judgment. But, who knows? I don't know, folks. Oh, Jesus. Okay, I got 13 minutes already on this thing, and <laughs> what did I talk about? Just railing my, um, railing like a, uh, who knows what. But anyway, folks, uh, it's, uh, boy, you know what? January, we should be having sub-zero Fahrenheit weather. <laughs> it should be 20 below. And it's 39.7. Jeez. Yeah, folks, I got government uh, on my computer, turning on my cameras, looking at me. Every, every as far as I'm concerned, 24 hours a day. So, and I only want peace and harmony. I, 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 I'm against these wars. All these things are, there's too much lying, folks. This new world order ain't going to go nowhere with all these lies. If we, if uh, the UFOs, the ETs are helping this government uh, blow up everybody, uh, Oh, we we got to be lying or playing uh, shenanigans with them too. 
or maybe uh, their uh, advanced technology were as stupid as the rest of the people. You know what? Uh, and reading that uh, thing that I that I talked about the other day, Nairobi. You know those people, Aunt Ananukis, they bleed just like you and me. Nuclear uh, bomb goes off. Uh, they get wiped out too. If the cloud of radiation blows over them, they get wiped out too. So, folks, uh, even though they live to be 100,000 years old, they bleed like the rest of us. So, if they need this planet's gold, well, they probably already got uh, plenty of it. And come back another uh, uh, 20, 20 million years and all the radiation will be gone. Or, or mine is guard. I'm sure they got uh, hazmat suits. So, folks, I don't know. I kind of give up on all this religion stuff. You know, you just don't hear the church... Uh, saying uh, peace, love, and harmony. So Jesus comes here and he's talking about this stuff. He was the, uh, if we take the Bible's version of what happened, the Romans didn't like him. The Jews did not like him. Um, so Crucified didn't bury now, apparently, the Anaki have this, uh, from, you know, reading that thing that I posted, this uh, secret potion to bring back to life. Or whatever. Uh, but anyway. So, that's it, folks. Uh, yeah, 17 minutes now. Well, this thing is still lit. Well, folks, be good to uh, other people. Be kind, be considered, be tolerant. Uh, help people when they need help. Don't wait to be asked for help, helping somebody. Put your best foot forward. Be a good person. Later, folks.